What's the Carrie Underwood song? Well, for your time. Carrie Underwood from the 2000s? I haven't looked into the songs much, but I've heard of them. Have you heard of Carrie Gibbon? If I may ask. We're looking at 1224. If the sound should still be in good condition, it'll take us a while to find the exact coordinates. We're working as hard as we can to find it. If I had to estimate, it should only take us a few weeks to track it down. So, uh, what's the story about that alien? We found it outside the ship and tried to rescue it, but... It was from our last trip. We went to a foreign part of Kepler 186F. We found this hostile primitive life instead of the family. The one in the jar managed to sneak its way onto the ship once we left. I found this on the planet. I think it's an instrument. It looks like a whistle. Try playing it. Did you have to play it so loudly? What's that noise? What? It says we're close to the fountain. It says here that it should only take us a few days at this rate. But you said it would take a few weeks. 7, 12, 19, and 3. There we have it. My coordinates kind of been off. It shows that we are closer to the destination. It's really weird, but I'm not complaining. It just means a shorter trip. I still didn't explain how we managed to skip several hundred light years in under two minutes. Now. Yeah. Are you sure it only says two minutes? I don't think he's lying. Look, we're nowhere near Kepler anymore. This isn't physically possible. There's no way anything with mass could travel ten times the speed of light. Let alone the fact that he was knowing. Well, what if it was a wormhole? It could have been. There doesn't seem to be any change in gravity. Maybe we should do an experiment then. What if the ship somehow malfunctioned and caused us to jump? Well, maybe we did something in here to cause the ship to warp. Okay, Gil, take these grips and see if the ship is damaged in any way. Got it. Well, let's see if anything in the machine caused the shift. Well, then we should retrace our steps. What was the last thing you did before your laptop went off? Well, right before the ship, Gil was playing the whistle. You were wondering about the fountain, and I was explaining the story about the alien. Well, I think we should take another look at the whistle. The shift did happen right after she played it. Good point. There's some kind of powder inside it. Well, what do you think it is? I think it's an anesthetic. Crunchy, where's the alien? I thought it was still on the table.